All right, uh, so for this roast, uh, you've already heard a bunch of Sebastian this, Sebastian that jokes and people being mean to him. He organized this, he wanted this, why? Because his girlfriend doesn't do it and this is the only way someone will say his name while fucking him. <laughs> <laughs> Leonard released a comedy special this year to honor his Chinese heritage. It's being re exclusively released at Pacific Mall as a bootleg DVD. <laughs> These are all Asian jokes. <laughs> Yeah. Well, Sebastian is a proud Italian, right? It's a very rich culture, even though Italian food is just 40 different shades of beet. <laughs> but Italians invented eyeglasses. Uh, and then Sebastian was born looking like this. <laughs> and that's what Italians wished they had invented birth control. <laughs> Leonard once went on a week-long silent retreat. It changed his life, but that club won't let him headline anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Because he sucks at comedy. Yeah. <laughs> I think they got the joke. Explaining. <laughs> yeah, explaining it always helps. <laughs> so, Sebastian makes people feel good that they're not him. Uh, he's the perfect target, you know? Like, he is basically an inflatable clown punching bag. <laughs> Right? He exists to be hit, and if he bounces back and hits you, who cares? Right? <laughs> like, he and his girlfriend actually have this in common. She's also inflatable. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> well, Leonard once wrote on Kim's convenience. And since then, his career has fallen off so much since he had to apply for a job at Kim's convenience. <laughs> The convenience store. <laughs> I'm cheating on my own. Oh, okay. After appearing on Just for Last and the Juno Awards, Leonard is confident his career is on the right track. Uh, he would know his people built them. <laughs> Blowing up. <laughs> <laughs> well, not internment joke. Who thinks Sebastian won that round? Who <laughs> thinks Leonard won that round? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who do you think won the round? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, you did a face. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, ready? Round two. Here we go. Leonard Chan first. Okay. <laughs> uh, as has been mentioned, Sebastian's mom is a white lady with dreads, aka James Franco's body double in Spring Breaker. <laughs> This is Sebastian's heritage, all right? His mom is an Italian Rastafarian, and his dad is absent. <laughs> According to Ancestry.com, Sebastian is Rasta Pasta Asta La Vista. Leonard, <laughs> <laughs> so, so. <laughs> you're about to talk. You look like you only eat pussy if it's mixed with MSG. <laughs> That wasn't a rebuttal. I'm not sure. Oh, that, was, that was styled as a rebuttal. I just don't know what MSA or pussy tastes like. I don't think you do. I only eat white people. Okay, so yes, Sebastian's dad uh, left his mom for a stripper. Uh, but Sebastian is nothing like his dad, and he will do what his dad could never do and live with his mom forever. <laughs> Yeah, well, Leonard played basketball for years and he still can't hit a layup, making the court another place an Asian can't drive. <laughs> Asian guy laughing, not getting canceled. Look, Asians can't drive, if I hit you, it'd be on purpose. So. <laughs> Sebastian had a tough childhood, right? But Sebastian doesn't live in the past because he knows that with his talent and work ethic, he has a whole future to ruin. <laughs> but seriously, he'll be fine because like his mom taught him, every little thing is gonna be all right. <laughs> Thank you, that's all.
in China. <laughs> Leonard worked as a chemist, an environmental engineer, and a factory worker. And as an adult, <laughs> That's three. Yeah, look at him. That's three. That's three. Count up the vote now. Count them now. All right. I think so. Last year, one of the other rounds. Woo! Which better one that round? Well, we'll play the third one anyway. <laughs> you wrote him, you might as well tell him. All right, round three, Leonard Chan. Here we go. All right, in Sebastian's beloved homeland of Italy, a judge ruled that sexual molestation lasting less than 10 seconds doesn't count. So based on that, Sebastian is technically still a virgin. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> Those bottles are killer, dude. <laughs> Leonard's wife, Jackie, is a vet. That's why their relationship works. She puts the dogs down and he eats them. <laughs> More Asian jokes. <laughs> oh, I'm just sorry. I thought you were going to dive into that well again. <laughs> All right. Sebastian, you know, we're talking about heritage. Sebastian often dresses up as Mario, <laughs> the video game plumber. But he's nothing like Mario. Instead of a career fixing toilets, his career is in the toilet. <laughs> he's more like Luigi, the unsuccessful brother nobody gives a shit about. <laughs> Right? Like, Mario is trademarked by Nintendo, a Japanese corporation, and that is the only thing Sebastian has in common with Mario, is that he's owned by Asians. <laughs> Speaking of Leonard's wife... <laughs> her legal name is Jackie Chan. Not true. The difference between her and the actor is when she stars in a movie with a black guy, I don't have to spend money on only for minutes. <laughs> Up that joke, but yes. <laughs> we got it. He meant only chance. <laughs> All right. Uh, Sebastian's dog Valentina died two years ago. He stayed with her until the very end, and it was an important moment in Sebastian's life because it was the first and only time he's ever been with a female when she finished. <laughs> She was 15. <laughs> she was 14. <laughs> Why are you going for that? <laughs> Security. Uh, <laughs> this joke is at two <laughs> Leonard's parents were devastated when he didn't marry an Asian. Sure, his wife might not be a Chang or a Lee, but she sure is a Ho. <laughs> I'm kidding, they're not disappointed she isn't Asian. They're disappointed their son only married a 3 out of 10. His <laughs> wife's here tonight. Is that 3? Who thinks Leonard won that one? Guys, once again, give it up for Leonard Chan!